Flying high in third place a month ago, Saint-Étienne have slipped down to seventh after claiming just one win in their last five outings. Stunned by promoted Trois last time out, Oscar Garcia's side were looking to get back on track at home to Ligue 1 Conferama's bottom side, Metz. Apart from a narrow win over Angers on week six, Metz have lost every single league outing this season and they've been rock bottom since the end of August. Well, top scorer Jonathan Bamba, a notable absentee for Le Ver, the young Frenchman dropped after refusing to negotiate a new contract with the club. That's due to a dispute over wages. In the meantime, Roman Hamuma went close early on. His shot beating Japan keeper Aiji Kawashima, but coming back off the post. And saint Etienne found themselves a goal down on 21 minutes. Centre-back Falotian sweeping home from a Mattia Dosovi corner. Very much against the run of play, this. Dian with his sixth goal in Ligue 1 Conferama, all of them coming from set pieces. Just getting ahead of his man there. And so 1 0 to the visitors at half time. Mess coming forward again early in the second period from a Saint Etienne man, Nolan Roux, picking up the ball and trying his look from outside the area. Stefan Ruffier forced to concede a corner. Roux spent two seasons at Saint-Étienne, scoring 13 league goals in 50 appearances. Saint-Étienne looking to get back on level terms, a quickly taken free kick, and Cabela testing Kawashima with a wicked drive. Good save there from the mess keeper. Well, the equaliser eventually arrived in the 74th minute after a bit of a goal-mouth scramble. Kevin Monet-Pake for Lois Dioni at the back post. Kevin Thierfar, Catherine's attempt was blocked. But there was Vincent Pajot to sweep in. His fifth goal in his third season with Le Vert. Slightly messy one, but they all count. And probably no less than the host deserved after dominating most of the game. Saint Etienne then with a golden opportunity to move in front six minutes from time. Gabriel Silva brought down by Chris Phillips. And the referee pointing to the spot. The man from Luxembourg can have no real complaints about that one. And Brian Tabo, the man to step up. But his penalty saved by Aiji Kawashima. He's now saved both of the penalties that he's faced in Ligue 1 Conferama. However, Tabo made up for it from the resulting corner. Getting on the end of Roman Hamuma's delivery and forcing Miguel Cafu into conceding an own goal. And that was 2-1. Much to the delight of the stand, Joffre Guichard. And to Oscar Garcia on the sidelines. It was even time for a third goal for Saint Etienne, deep in injury time. Clever interplay between Cabela and Alexander Soderlund. And a cool finish from Habi, but Maiga. A first league gun goal for the 21-year-old Ivorian, a product of the Sante youth system. And that was enough to seal a 3-1 victory. Saint-Étienne finally back to winning ways, and they were up to third on Saturday night.